Performing a hydrostatic test. First, make sure the pump is in proper working condition. For example, gas and oil levels, the parts intact, and so forth. Second, hooking up the pump. Connect the pump to your water supply. Make sure all connections are tight and that there are no leaks. For suction or gravity feed models, such as the DP2B, in order to suction feed properly, the pump must not be more than eight feet from the water source. Always make sure there is an adequate supply of water. Third, start the unit and perform an isolated test before hooking the pump up to your test environment. To do this, place a ball valve onto the end of your 8-foot outlet hose supplied with the unit and use the outlet hose as your simulated test environment, verifying the unit is working properly and to preset your test pressures. Fourth, connect the outlet hose to the test environment and allow the unit to build up to your required test pressure. Once pressure is met and the air is bled from the system, close the ball valve on the unit and shut off the engine simultaneously. Allow the unit and test environment to sit, holding pressure for your required test time. We hope this video has helped you better understand our test pumps and will serve as an educational tool in your rental business. Feel free to call us with any questions you may have. For those of you with internet access, check out our website. We're proud of the business relationship we have established with you, our customers, and hope to continue serving you in the future. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching.